One of the greatest obstacles that I see why people don't use hyperbaric oxygen therapy enough and why people don't get all these wonderful benefits that the therapy can provide is that HBOT is perceived to be a very expensive therapy. So people check out the price maybe in just one place, uh, look at it from a standpoint that hyperbaric therapy requires many sessions for it to uh, have benefits for health and forgo the idea of doing it. Now, in this video, I'd like to tell you about different ways of how you can access hyperbaric therapy to avoid overspending, do it on a budget, to get all the wonderful health benefits that this therapy has to offer. I will also talk about potential scams that can happen in the industry so you can spot it right away and avoid it. There are three ways that we can access hyperbaric therapy. You can go to a hospital or a clinic and get your hyperbaric sessions there. You can rent a hyperbaric chamber or you can buy a hyperbaric unit for home use. Now, with a clinic or a hospital, that's pretty straightforward. This is how we're used to get any therapy that we get. We go to see a doctor, we go to a clinic, and we get our sessions there. Hospital units or hospital sessions tend to be a lot more expensive than the same hyperbaric sessions in a smaller clinic. Also, a clinic that is located in a very posh area, somewhere where the cost of rent is very expensive, they normally would charge more for their hyperbaric sessions that the clinic that is located in not so nice areas. So keep that in mind. And if you decide that going to the clinic or accessing hyperbaric therapy at a hospital is the way for you to go, make sure that you do your research. Call 10 different clinics uh, in the half an hour, 40 minute vicinity drive and inquire what is the cost of doing hyperbaric therapy there. When you buy a single session, it's always more expensive than getting hyperbaric sessions in packages. The less is the cost of package in terms of per session. Also, many clinics have incentives. Inquire about those incentives. And by incentives, I mean that sometimes you can purchase an unlimited number of sessions if you complete them within a certain time period. Also, many clinics, knowing that the frequency of hyperbaric treatments is super important, will give you a discount if you complete your hyperbaric sessions in the shortest time possible. Let's say you buy a package of 10 and you do 10 sessions within two weeks. So this is your way of going to a clinic and getting your hyperbaric sessions there. Hospital setting will most likely be way more expensive because hospitals are used to working with insurance companies. They usually treat approved indications. So the cost of the, of the reimbursement is much higher. Therefore, unless it's a life-threatening situation, I recommend that you choose a private clinic and see uh, whether or not you can get um, um, sessions there. There are also charities, especially in the UK, there are MS, multiple sclerosis charities that offer hyperbaric treatments. The cost of the treatment in a clinic run by a charity is usually lower than the cost of the session at the regular clinic. There's also an option of renting a hyperbaric chamber. It is a less known option. Usually people either choose to go to a clinic or they decide to buy a hyperbaric chamber for their home use. Advantages of renting a hyperbaric unit for home use is that you get to try it for a certain number of sessions. Let's say you do a one month rental. So in one month, depending on your hyperbaric protocol, you can fit from 10 to 30 sessions or sometimes even more. And you can assess your progress and to see whether or not this therapy should be the therapy of choice for you. Also, when you rent a hyperbaric chamber, your other members of the family can use that chamber as well. If hyperbaric, if they don't have contraindications to hyperbaric therapy, of course, if you'd like to learn about contraindications, watch my videos. I list all the contraindications and possible side effects in those videos. 
So renting is also a good option. Sometimes you can rent directly from a manufacturer or you can have a middleman company that is renting hyperbaric chambers. They will come to your house, they will install the chamber, then they will collect the chamber when um, the period of rental is over. Disadvantages to that is that um, normally companies don't rent brand new units, so it will be an older unit. Um, if eventually you decide to buy a hyperbaric chamber, you have this additional cost of renting first unless you are renting and buying from the same manufacturer then they usually will include the cost of the rental in the price of a chamber they will most likely rent you a, a new chamber and then if you decide to go further with your treatments and buy a hyperbaric chamber you can get the same chamber and the price of the rental will be discounted or included in the cost of your purchase there is another option, third option, which I really like. It's buying a home hyperbaric unit. And let me explain why. At the beginning, this might seem like a big investment because you're not just investing in 20 hyperbaric sessions as you do it at the clinic or for a one month or two months rental. You're investing in the whole thing, but you also buy hyperbaric chambers once every 10 years. These units usually have a five-year warranty if you buy from a reputable manufacturer. If you use it carefully, it will run for years. It will be your own chamber that you can use as many times as you like. Your family members can use it, your neighbors. You can invite people over to hyperbaric parties you will get the benefits of hyperbaric chamber of hyperbaric therapy for years to come if you do it to boost your health if you do it for anti-aging if you have a chronic condition most likely hbot will be something that you will be doing for many months and years if it's just a mild concussion and you need 10 12 sessions to resolve it probably going to the clinic would be a better option. If you plan to incorporate hyperbaric therapy into your daily routine to improve your health, to improve longevity, to get all the wonderful benefits that increased amount of oxygen and pressure has to offer, then buying a hyperbaric unit, investing in one, would be a better option because if you think about this investment in terms of number of times that you will be using it, the cost per session would be a lot lower if you have your own hyperbaric unit than if you keep going to the clinic for months and years. I promised you to talk about scams. So uh, one thing that I never recommend is buying a secondhand chamber directly from an individual unless you know this person really well and i'll explain why hyperbaric chambers are sturdy they're made to last however if you don't use it carefully or if somebody attempts a repair themselves rather than repairing their hyperbaric chamber in a manufacturing facility or through an authorized dealer so if somebody thinks that they're a good engineer, that they're a good electrician, and they can repair a hyperbaric chamber, they do it themselves. First of all, this chamber is no longer covered by warranty. But secondly, they can do something because uh, it's not their day-to-day -day job to repair hyperbaric chambers. So with the best intentions, this person can do something to damage the chamber, and then this equipment becomes absolutely unsafe to use. Therefore, if you want to get a second-hand chamber, which is also possible, contact a manufacturer or an authorized reseller and ask them if they have any second-hand units in stock. Those units have been tested by a manufacturer to make sure that they're safe to use, that they're up and running. Maybe you can purchase an additional insurance, ask them about it, but that way you can be sure that you're getting a unit that will last and that it's safe to use. In my opinion, safety is the number one important thing with hyperbaric oxygen therapy. 
uh, your chamber needs to be safe and please of course when you do your research on which make and which company to buy your hyperbaric chamber from look at their safety record some companies um, i particularly use this american brand they have 100 percent safety record this is super important that means then in 30 years of them manufacturing and selling hyperbaric chambers nothing ever happened to that chamber i hope this helps there are several ways as i said to getting your therapy done you can go to the clinic you can rent a chamber you can buy a hyperbaric unit you can get a new unit you can get a used unit if you're getting it directly from a manufacturer or um, an authorized reseller there are different makes some chambers are more expensive some are more affordable depending on the pressure that they go to also depending on other features that they might have of course it's, it's a big purchase it's like buying a car so you really want to do your research firsthand but once you're sure that this is the unit that you want to get you get it you get it installed in your house and then you can use it at your convenience which will make it a lot more likely that you will be compliant with your hyperbaric protocol that you will do a certain number of sessions to see results i hope it helps if you have any questions and i'm sure you do especially about different manufacturers different makes of hyperbaric therapy or sometimes i get a question about the ms uh, charity societies and things like that please leave your comments and i will make sure to answer your questions i love your comments i love when you participate when you give me ideas so please do and i'll see you next week